Hey, this is Dark God of Games here, showing you how to be King Boom Boo in Sonic Adventure 2. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is go and open up your em emulator. And you're going to need a null DC emulator. And if you don't have that and you're using Chancast, if you have the null DC uh, plugin, then you can still do this. So you're going to want to open up your game normally and go to options select plugins and then where it says power VR in uh, parentheses graphics plugin you're going to want to select null PVR which is the one I have right here you might already have this selected but you might want to double check once you have that, hit OK. You go to, back to options. Go to power VR. You're going to have aspect ratio. You're going to change that from stretch or whatever you have it on to extra GM. Go back again. Power VR. Piloted textures. Dynamic full. Back again sort for triangle which slows this down and then modifier volumes and volumes now the reason we do these three the aspect ratio the textures and the sort is just to slow my it's just to slow the computer down now you don't need these three on you can just do this last one but I do it just to slow my computer down so it's easier to beat them I'm gonna go and start the game normally. And this should be pretty easy to do. You don't have to use any certain techniques. You just have to beat it how you normally would on a console. So you're gonna go open up your game normally go to story to where you're stuck on King Boom Boo and now everything should have a shadow looking like this now King Boom Boo doesn't have a shadow right now but once he goes underground he will And I'm sorry that my sound is really crappy, but I've got, for some reason, my emulator doesn't work well on this computer. So, you're going to avoid these fireballs, wait for him to blow a wall of fire, you run, hit the ghost, flip that thing over, and make the sun come out. Now, as you can see, King Boom Boo now has a shadow. Wait for him to shake. And then you dig, get him, start running, and punch him. You're gonna have to do this about four times. And unless you can do it fast enough, you're probably going to have to do it four times. Because if you do it fast enough, you can probably hit him more than once at a time. So that's basically it.